as the abdominal aorta descends, it eventually bifurcates or forks. And right over here at this point, we have the two common iliac arteries. So this would be the right common iliac, and this would be the left common iliac. As each common iliac descends, look at the one on the right, you can see that the common iliac gives rise to two more branches. This branch is going to go to the pelvis, and it is going to be the internal iliac artery. And this branch is going to leave the pelvis, go underneath the inguinal ligament, and this is the external iliac artery. Here again is the external iliac artery. If you follow it down, it's going to go underneath the inguinal ligament and come out as the femoral artery, which you find right over here.